I'm Rod Rodriguez, and this is three takeaways from episode 28 with Alex Miller. So in this episode, uh, we talked with British soldier Alex Miller about his company, GenKit Exchange, and it's really fascinating. Lots of different parallels between uh, the American and British veterans. So it makes you wonder, is this just veterans in general? Is there a, a current that runs through every veteran that is – there's a calling. There's something that says, I want to be an entrepreneur. I want to own my own business. So this leads us to takeaway number one. The combination of veterans either serving or ex-serving and that entrepreneurship and the problems that they face in that world is, it, it's a killer combo. It mm-hmm. really is that they fucking, the, the problems and the, the veracity that the, you can a- attack those sort of problems and questions with just is so just some civilians just don't have it they would just constantly look for reasons to not do it whereas you know veterans have had the hardships whether it's just you know sitting sitting in a ship field in the rain it's just that knowing you know what this isn't that bad actually i can do this risk is at the top of the reasons people don't go forward with their ideas for entrepreneurship with their business ideas risk so alex has a great way for you to kind of put things in perspective which leads us to take away number two. What I would do is, the best advice I could give is write down the 10 worst things that could possibly happen if you did what you're thinking about. So whether it's starting your company or doing this, this or this, write down the 10 worst things that could possibly happen. And then imagine all of those things actually happen in the worst case scenario. How difficult would it be to get back to where you are right now and if it's not that hard, and it usually 90% of the time, I mean, I'm regurgitating a lot of this from Tim Ferriss, but it's just so brilliant. I just want as many people to know as possible that if it is easy and 90% of the time it is going to be easy, it's not the impossible to get back to where you originally were, then fucking right, you should do it. On that list of reasons people don't start their own small businesses is usually, I don't have time. I just don't have time. I got a thousand other things happening. I got the kids. I got this job. I got this. I got that. I just don't have the time. I don't have the, the, I'm not going to prioritize starting my business. And to that, Alex has an answer, which leads us to takeaway number three. Yeah, definitely. They've got so many good ideas. You're right there. I was saying that they're on target. They are fucking on target. So many ideas. People come up to me with so many. I was thinking about doing this. I'm like, fuck, I should have done that. That's a great idea. And I'm like, why aren't you doing it? He's like, oh, I can't be bothered. And I'm like, but you want to be in the army for 24 years. You will be bothered to do that. All right. That was three takeaways from episode 28 of the After Action Review podcast with Alex Miller of GenKit Exchange. If you want to learn more about GenKit Exchange, you can go to www.genkit.co.uk. Again, that's www.genkit.co.uk and learn more, more about GenKit Exchange. Now, uh, that does it for me. I will see you at episode 28 of the After Action Review podcast. 